Welcome back to Magic Tarot Cards. Today we're going to do a daily energy for uh, July 2026, which would be tomorrow on Friday, uh, 2024. All right, it's for all zodiac signs. Let's see what's coming in for you tomorrow for love, money, health, um, any other thing that might be coming in. All right, don't forget this channel is branded. You do not have permission to copy it for any reason. If you'd like a person reading, contact me with the information down below. Text me and I'll get back at you. I'm still running the $10 special for a few more days. You get three questions for $10. And don't forget to hit that notification bell so you'll be reminded when I upload another video. Okay, be respectful in the comments. All trolls, you are out. I will not hesitate to delete you and have your page deleted as well. Any type of harassment is not permitted here or any place else. Even though you don't mention my name, um, and you still try to harass, that's still a crime on YouTube. YouTube is very strict, and they will boot you out, and I will not hesitate to have you deleted. <laughs> Let's get that straight right now. I don't put up with any type of harassment, trolls, or whatever. Do not underestimate my power. All right. Let's get started with the reading. I am using my beautiful cup represents pray 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 i love this cup got it at walmart i'm drinking just water here's my little straw it keeps sinking to the bottom and then my cup which helps you manifest good luck and love money and health i've put an influence on this cup yes i can do that been a tarot card reader for more than 30 years psychic and uh, i can help you manifest all kinds of things there's nothing i can't tell you um if you need to know anything about anything all right i've studied with the best my ancestors so let's get moving with this video. I'm going to back up this camera just a bit here. Now we're going to have energies for all zodiac signs for July 2026. 2026. July 20. July. I'm sorry. I'm saying that wrong. July 26 for 2024. I have this uh, 26 in my head for some reason. All right, so this is for July 26, which is tomorrow on Friday for the year 2024 daily energy. We're going to go with this one here. In tarot, I work with spirit directly. They give me the abilities to do all kinds of things, and they pull the cards for me, or I... Um, I pull them with my own psychic abilities. All right, show me tomorrow. Show me tomorrow. For August twenty, there we go. August twenty, August twenty-six. I keep saying, wanting to say twenty twenty-six. It's August twenty-six for tomorrow. August twenty-six. There we go. We got one there. August twenty-six. We are going to take that one. When you get a bunch of cards that fall um, in tarot, you usually go with the the first one that your mind sees, that your eye sees. All right. For those of you that don't know that. Um, yeah, that's how that works. Or the card that flips. See, the, 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 you got several cards that flipped here. The first one that you see is that one. All right. <sighs> All right. So I think that should be it right there. I'm being told to stop. So for the first one, we have the uh, Seven of Pentacles. I'll read from past, present to future in the daily energies. So it looks like some of you may be low on money. You've worked very hard here. See how he's worked hard. He stacked up his coins. He's thinking. Blue, blue always represents deep thought thinking. And... Um, yeah, and he's still got one more coin here. So he's thinking about, okay, I've done this, that, and that. But I still got more to do. But it's in the reverse. So it looks like your energy is low. You might have lost money or your money has been low for some reason uh, due to job loss or just not enough work or, um, you know, in between jobs or someone else is taking your money or something like that. But never fret because I am seeing, I'm seeing that for a um, Taurus worker Capricorn. But I'm also seeing someone building their own money. For some of you that have ideas about being an entrepreneur, Entrepreneur, building your own business, building your own money, that will go well if you start it now. Start it before August 4th, all right, or after August, and that will go well for you. I'm, I'm especially seeing a uh, Taurus Virgo Capricorn here. This is the card of entrepreneur, self made millionaire. She's standing here amongst the coins. She's got her hand stacked on the coins, her bank account. If you notice, there's a lot of fruit in the back representing fruitful um, activities that she has done, build her own business, the yellow 
represents, she's even wearing yellow, represents everything brand new day. She's standing on yellow. So this money has really brought her a lot of security, financial security. There's a bird on her arm. Birds always represent messages coming through. What's the message? The message is slow moving money. There's a snail moving very slow, building it up a little bit at a time. So don't ever rush into anything. Take baby steps one step at a time, and you will get there. So I am seeing good luck in that. For some of you, I'm seeing that you need to um, build your, uh, you're trying to, uh, how do you say this, uh, find balance in your life. Because you're, one foot is stepped in the water, which is very turbulent, and then the other one's on the outside, which is more calm. So you're trying to step out of the turbulence in your life. You're pouring water here and here, which is the life flow. You're trying to balance it out. See, so she's trying to balance out her life flow here. In deep thought, blue always, always represents in deep thought. Why is she naked, though? Why is she naked? Represents innocence, all right? Represents that you're innocent to what has happened. You want to start over fresh, new. So you're starting a new um, way of doing things, finding balance, a new way of finding balance. You want to start over, all right? Uh, a baby, when a baby is born, is born naked, right? So it's innocent, it's fresh, a new start. So that's what this represents. There's another bird representing um, this is what you need to do. You're protected by the heavens. Here's all the stars protected by the heavens. So some of you are going to start a new start, a new fresh beginning, and that's always a good thing. All right, find your strength. Find your strength. And then some of you will be traveling. Your travel is successful. I'm especially seeing uh, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here traveling. You'll be well received. Again, do not travel after August 4th because of Mercury retrograde. But you will be well received here. You could be traveling for a job or to go see someone. Uh, you see that a horse is moving forward, but he's looking straight at you, meaning he is arriving. He has arrived. The people are greeting him. Uh, well received. Lots of love here. Wands always represent love and emotion. Lots of love. This person is in deep thought. Other people are in deep thought about you, and you're being well received on this travel. Some of you are waiting for an important message. All right. So this message is going to come by um, text, email, phone call, a letter, or something like that. I'm seeing three days, three weeks, or three months. A um, lot of deep thought here about this, but this page is uh, pages always mean messages. They're messengers, all right? In the tarot, the pages are messengers. They always bring a message. What is the message here? It's good news. Good news is coming. Again, he's protected. Um, he's just, he's protected by life. He's protected by the heavens. Why? Because there's salamanders on his robe here. So this is a person that's well protected, waiting on a message. So you could be waiting on a message about a court date, about money coming in, about love, about health. Um, and you're in deep thought. You've been in deep thought about this. And you've been waiting for quite a while is what I see. But whatever the message is, it's going to be good. I'm seeing a lot of Aries, Leo, Sagittarius here. All right. And then again, we have the pentacles in the reverse. This is only for some of you that your money might be low or in stagnation. This is, again, another card that just like this one as entrepreneur, uh, someone that holds their own money, own bank account. But some of it might be on lockdown. I'm seeing money on lockdown, money on hold or a check or, or a bonus. Mainly a bonus is what I'm seeing that might be on hold. Why? Because the planet Mercury is coming and it slows things down. It doesn't mean it's going to stay that way. This is a court card and it will flip back up. All right. So we got to wait for that energy to pass. Pray it in. Call it in. Always call in things. The universe can hear you. The spirits can hear you. They listen to what you say. Never speak negative because whatever you speak negative is what you draw to. You always speak positive. And I am going to say this. Don't you know that if you, um, especially if this is for the trolls, if you say something negative to about another person, you actually become that because that's how karma works. If you say a person is ugly, you actually become ugly. Your face starts changing. Your facial features start changing. And then that's how people start seeing you. So everything, every time you speak negative of someone, that is what you're drawing to yourself. All right. You call people names then that's what you become, all right? Think twice about what you say about to other people or how you talk about other people or how you treat other people because everything that you say, it will come right back to you and that's what you will become. You will be that in other people's eyesight, all right? And that's just the way karma works. Like it, don't like it. Karma is going to get you one way or the other if you don't take care of your mouth, all right? So that's just a strong warning from spirit. Be careful what you say, what you put out to the universe because um, you will draw that into yourself, all right? This is Jasmine from Magic Tarot Cards. <laughs>